an absolute lackluster day of trade is what we witnessed and we ended pretty much mixed but flat amidst volatility. If you see in terms of today's session, uh, Nifty 50, we were still able to hold those 18,650 uh, levels in trade today. And you had Sensex as well, which ended below the 63,000 uh, mark. The advanced decline ratio overall was pretty much in favor of the bulls. But clearly, there is that consolidation which has continued. And being a truncated week, being a week uh, where we will see FNO expiry, that's the reason the volatility has remained high. Uh, overall, if you see in terms of where uh, sectors were concerned, it was mainly the auto as well as the pharma pack, uh, which was showing some kind of strength in today's session. But apart from that, you had a lot of pressure that did come in in terms of, uh, you know, uh, in terms of the other sectors as well. You had RIL, which dragged, whereas ICICI Bank, m and m led the positive change in the markets. Let's look at the top gainers, Sipla, Adani Enterprises, Hiromoto, Tata Consumers, as well as m and m were the top gainers, whereas NTPC, RIL, Power Grid, TCS, as well as Coal India were the top losers in trade today. In terms of the newsmakers, Bina, uh, BPCL was in focus on the back of a maintained shutdown that they will be taking for 35 days. Railtel on the back of an order win. Adani Power has started commercial operations at their Goda Thermal Power Plant, so good moves came in there. Parag Milk Foods was up in trade as six ventures, six cents ventures has bought additional stake. And you had drone companies like Parents Defense, Zen, Zen Technologies, which were up in trade on the back of the government order where export uh, delicensing has been taken over. Uh, Zydus saw an up move on the back of the acquisition. ICSI Securities at a 14 month high as the parent is considering delisting. And you had Tree Cement, which was trading under pressure on the back of the tax probe. So, overall, a lot of movers and shakers in trade today, but a market of consolidation. And this is something which is expected to continue as per analysts.